everyone! So, welcome to my channel. This week I have documented my whole week of how I go through losing weight sustainably and healthily whilst on my period. I know a lot of women struggle with, I have struggled with this so much in the past, but I've made small swaps and small changes and learned a few things to help me get through it. Not come out on the other uh, end feeling really upset and mad at myself because I completely binged or whatever. So this morning, first things first, I woke up and it was literally morning one, day one of my period. And I did a 30 minute workout. And I have to tell you guys now, if it was any any other time I would not have done that but because my friend Pav is staying here and we told each other we'd work out in the morning we were gonna do an hour we compromised because she still wanted to work out for half an hour instead of the full hour if I had woken up and I wasn't having a sleepover last night or whatever I can guarantee you I wouldn't have done that workout but it was because I was doing it with a friend I just felt more inclined to and a bit more motivated and literally while we're physically doing a workout you push each other a little bit more so yeah I just want to put that disclaimer out there because I don't want to set really unrealistic expectations and make you all feel bad for not doing a workout on the first day of your period because it is not even like me it's not normal for me to do either so my brother is here and Pav and we are putting our brunch slash lunch together after our workout and I'll show you what we've made at the end So at about 2pm that same day, my lovely Henry came round with the goods, he bought some crisps, he bought some peppers, cucumbers, and we had a whole bag of buttons between us, and it was absolutely delicious. Then I went ahead and started making dinner, I was making my one pot pasta, and if you don't know this recipe, go check it out on my Instagram, it's so easy, and oh my god, the most delicious thing in the world. Good morning, my love. It is Monday, which is day two of my period. Couple things to mention, last night I had four bags of crisps and two chocolate bars and a little bit more chocolate when nobody was looking <laughs> upstairs in bed so late and I also ate pretty much a whole bag of strawberry laces to myself and you know what I feel really guilty um usually I say you know don't feel guilty there's no point you may as well just get off and move on and kind of get on with it the next day but today because I had worked so hard over the rest of the weekend literally yesterday in the day i was i was fairly okay like pretty standard and pretty good for a period day today i did really well we didn't overeat i kept doing calories including eating out and having a night in with a friend last night i just i, I feel like i ruined it for myself if i'm totally honest but in saying that what can i do now at this stage what can i do i just need to pick myself back up mentally get ready have some weetabix for breakfast have lots and lots of water today and just crack on and get back into the calorie counting and don't go over calories today so i'm having some honey and wheat bakes for breakfast today and i'm having normal milk instead of oat milk because i don't think i'm getting enough calcium in my diet but yeah this is my breakfast so i have got a mount in my car but it's for my camera i'm just gonna hope my phone doesn't fall for now oh my god my dad's parked so close to me right now i'm just driving to the gym as you can probably tell oh and i'm in such a rush as always it is really hard i can't lie trying to juggle like gym going to the gym during the day whilst work whilst working so i'm lucky that i've got a boss that's relaxed and he says you know it's fine it's good for you to make time to go to the gym and things like that so he's understanding and if i didn't have that i'd really really struggle if you are someone who does struggle a bit and can't really find the hour to have a full hour to go work out try to do a half an hour workout three times monday to friday it honestly makes the biggest difference you may think oh when you're doing half the amount i should you're not you're not you're doing 30 minutes more than you would normally <laughs> so you're doing 30 minutes extra you can't look at it the half is the glass is half empty the glass is always half full yeah, let's get ready guys in three two one let's go three minutes to one Oh, I'm literally dying. I just finished the session. 56 minutes, 560, three calories. And I'm gonna go home now. 
I don't even mind eating on a call, but it's the fact that I haven't showered yet. My skin breaks out so bad. Oh my God. So I'm literally having the most hectic day straight from gym into a meeting on the phone on the way back and straight into another meeting. I had a shower for like, I had 10 minutes in between meetings, had a shower, washed my hair, everything. I've just come off that meeting. I've got another one in five. I'm going to quick bag of squares, 99 calories. I'm driving to my boyfriend tonight, 45 minutes away. And we're going to have eggs for dinner. <laughs> so one of the best things I did during my weight loss journey was having eggs as a main meal every single day. Whether it was lunch, breakfast or dinner, I always made sure I had it as one of my main meals in the day. And it was just an easy way to rely on a really low calorie and super easy and convenient like dish to cook. And it always turns out so tasty. I absolutely love it. But by the way, guys, this didn't actually fill me up. I had another slice of uh, bagel and I just wanted to let you guys know. <laughs> I couldn't buy any ice cream, they were so over frozen, overpriced. By the way guys, this is the best bread ever. Isn't this the best bread ever? Good to you now. <laughs> yeah. Bedtime. Bedtime of night two. And I'm having... <laughs> I'm having um, uh, options hot chocolate, which are... The best, by the way, 40 calories for, is it three or four scoops? Four. Good morning, everyone. So it's day three, it's Tuesday of my period. I'm driving home now before work starts at nine. And they've got a little bagel, a sandwich, and I thought I'd charge my watch last night, but I didn't. So I'm gonna charge it in the car, because obviously I'm not gonna be doing any steps in the car, so it shouldn't matter too much. But yeah, so I'm gonna just crack on, drive home, takes about 40 minutes, uh, get myself in the front door and get going for the day. Try to get my steps up today because I'm not working out. But yeah, it'll be good to show you how I managed to get my steps up, if I do, hopefully I do. Not the best weather, it looks sunny right now, but it's raining. It's a non-gym day, so I haven't even got that to rely on. Just got home. Is it just me? But there's always this one morning or one day in the middle of my period where I just feel like I look skinny. <laughs> I just feel like I look good. And today I'm having that morning where I'm just like, yeah, do you know what? I don't look terrible. Doesn't look too bad come tomorrow i will feel like a whale but that's okay it's just part of the period process isn't it oh my god it's only half 10 and i feel hungry and sick I'm really tired i've had a coffee i don't really know what to do like i feel like that's sickly hungry where you should probably eat some like carbs or something so i might go do that I don't really know what to eat. Oh, I hate days like this. So I've come upstairs. I'm still feeling really sick. Um, but I'm gonna have some cravers. Are they gonna make me feel any better? Probably not. But are they gonna taste really good? Probably. Oh, I was just going through one of my boxes and I was looking at all the candles that I got for my birthday. They're so cute. I just posted them on my Instagram. Um, and I was just looking through some of like my other presents. I just found this box of more cheeses and now I just really want to eat it. And I'm just really it's so noisy, isn't it? The calories. So, how much is the box? 110. Like five and over 500 calories in the whole box. I really want to do it though. No, okay. If I open it. Okay, guys, I'm going to save it for the weekend because I'll share it then. And I'll share it with Henry. And then that's only really 250 calories instead of 500. While I was putting that away, I found the last five and I bar that we have in the drawer. So I'm going to eat that. Life is such a mess. My life is actually such a mess. But the one thing I have going good for me is this one pot chicken pasta. I'm so happy I meal prepped this the other day. Like, I don't feel necessarily stressed out at the moment, but I do feel like, oh, really tired and a little bit like I've got a lot to do. And my room is a mess and that stresses me out. <laughs> So it's just nice that when it comes to lunchtime, I know I've got my lunch sorted. I know what my breakfast usually is. And for dinner tonight, I'm probably just going to have like eggs with sausage or something and some nimble bread, you know. So I just wanted to come on here quick because I don't know if it's because I'm not as busy as I was yesterday. But I am struggling so much today. I feel sick. I just feel so tired. I haven't pushed myself to go up and go for a walk yet. It's 20 to 5. How many steps have I done? I've done 1,300 steps. <laughs>
I just, I'm literally struggling so much today and every period I have a day like today. I do need to get my ca camera out of the closet. It's probably covered in absolute layers of dust. So I'm just gonna have an omelette, but I'm gonna, oh, fucking hell, you scared me. <sighs> Today I'm gonna have an omelette. I'm gonna have chicken and spinach in it. Not chicken, uh, chicken sausages and spinach in it. So we've got a few things going on here. We've got the bacon and the sausage, and I've got my eggs ready and some spinach. And like yesterday, we're gonna have some bagels. They're the ones I had yesterday, but my dad has bought these tomato and herb ones, which look nice. They're less calories, but I'm just not sold. We'll see, I'll let you know. <laughs> I'm too scared to hold my phone up properly to record because I don't want people to know that I'm recording myself. There's literally so many cars everywhere, but it's like, what time is it? Quarter to seven and I'm finally up for my first walk of the day. Bear in mind, I said I'd go on one at like, 12 and again one at like five and i didn't first walk of the day and i'm walking to my friend's house um just gonna walk there and then walk home i don't really know how long the walk is i think it's like 20 minutes so it's not too long but i brought some sugar to keep me going um it's so true that when you're in your period you naturally burn more calories because of your um metabolic rate is higher naturally like organically because your body temperature isn't actually higher so you tend to need a few mix, a few more calories when you're on your period compared to when you're not on your period. Starting it again, heading home. It's much later. It's ten to eight. Just coming back from the shop now. Another half an hour. So I've done like an hour together, which is double what I said I would. So I'm pretty happy. I would love to tell you I've done ten thousand steps, but watch. I've only done eight point four. And as good as I am, I had done less than 2,000 before I left for a walk, so I'm really proud of myself. I haven't changed my bedroom light bulb yet. Wait. Ah, oh. spotlights on me, honey. Let's taste test this. It's a little bit melted. Like I said on my Instagram story, I bought it and then we had to walk 15 minutes home, so why did I do that? These are popcorn sort of caramel flavoured co-op. They are £1.85, which I think is very good considering Halo Top is such a rip-off at the moment. It's £5 and I just think like as much as I like Halo Top and it's so great that there's a low calorie option, I think that is so expensive. Like for an ice cream, that is very expensive. So Halo Top, can you reduce your prices please? Oh my god, it's like popping candy. Can you hear that? I don't think you can. Do you know what? This is delicious. <laughs> Hello everybody. It is Wednesday morning. Today I have the gym. Gym when you're on your period takes a little bit more effort, like getting yourself there I mean, but you actually burn more calories on your period. It's like what I was talking about last night. I hit 25k on Instagram last night. I can't believe it because the day before I started this vlog, we hit 20. It's just moving up so fast and that's just incredible. This evening is the first ever live fitness class that I'm doing and I'm doing it with eFitness. Obviously you won't be able to see this uh, before. This will be out after I've done the class. So ask me, please comment down below how the class went, how many people attended um, and if we feel it was successful or not so i had a wheat mix for breakfast with a bit of honey oh my glasses um and it's about half an hour before the gym so i'm having a coffee which is like my pre-workout one of the gym pts told me to do this instead of buying pre-workout i'll be doing it and it's been working so i'd recommend and to save your coin guys you don't need to buy pre-workout just get some coffee gym time going to the gym now not got the cutest outfit on but it's all right it's just the gym i think i'm just gonna do 30 minutes because i am doing that class with you guys tonight and i don't want to overdo myself and then not be able to put that like put everything my full into the class i'm doing with you guys tonight but then a part of me is like that's such an excuse you can do both but then another part of me is like can you can you really hey guys part two is up now youtube only let me upload for 15 minutes sorry